theory of machine we come across various elements where we are having forces acting on numbers and now we are going to discuss about the equilibrium of a two force number so it is a static condition for a number to be in equilibrium and if it is acted by two forces these conditions should be satisfied the first condition says the magnitude of forces should be same then this forces should be in opposite side and they should act along the same line so we can describe it as if we are having this is our link and two forces f1 and f2 are acting along this link the first condition is that this f1 and f2 should have same magnitude that is magnitude of f1 is equal to magnitude of f2 so that is if f2 is 5 newton f1 will also be 5 newton second thing they should be opposite in sign that is the direction of action of the forces should be opposite so vector f1 will be equal to negative vector f2 now the last condition they should be along the same line of action that means if two forces are acting in two line of action as shown in figure they will form a couple so that we will need a, another term to compensate that couple but if there is only two forces acting in a system then they should be along the same line to keep it in the equilibrium position so for a two force number to be in equilibrium the magnitude of forces should be same they should act in opposite direction and they should act along the same line of action